Hi guys, it's Lo, and today I'm back with this look. This is a smoky look made with cool and warm tones using Personal Cosmetics Identity 2 palette. I think this palette is really really cute. It has all the essentials to create sultry and smoky looks. The list of the product will be listed down below. These are affiliate links and it helps me to create content for Instagram and YouTube. My first step is always to prep my skin with a nice moisturizer. Then I'm using Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation and a blending sponge from Juno & Co. I put some dots on all my face so the product is nicely distributed and I blend everything with my damp beauty sponge. This foundation looks pretty natural which I really like and you can see it has a medium coverage. Next, a little bit of concealer on my big pimple here. And I like to dab um, the surrounding of the pimple with my finger and the sponge. And also I have some imperfections here and there. Now I'm bronzing my face. Uh, I see myself bronzing my face uh, more than contouring these days. I think it looks more natural and this is a much quicker step. And here is the blush. This one is really cute because it feels natural and it has a radiant finish. This is from Thrive Cosmetics. Next, this is the highlighter. I'm using that big fat brush. So it creates a nice diffuse look on all over the face. And I add a little bit more product onto the cupid's bow like this. And a little bit on the bridge of my nose. So it creates more volume and definition. And because the product is very pigmented, I'm using a big brush like this to soften up the highlighter. Now moving on to the brows. This is the most annoying part for me. I think it takes such a long time and it's never the same shape. But this is a step that I really, really need because my eyebrows are so sparse, especially on the end. Now this is the fun part, I'm using Personal Cosmetics Identity 2 palette. I'm using this Morphe brush, this is a big fat one, so it creates a nice diffused eyeshadow look. The first shade I'm using is Passionate, I really like this one because it's very warm but it has a rosy undertone, I think it's really really pretty. Nice transition shade and also you can use it on all over the lid like this. And you see it's very very pigmented uh, so a little goes a long way and I'm diffusing the rest of the eyeshadow onto the rest of my eyes with a nice fluffy brush I'm using independent it has a cool undertone this is a beautiful gunmetal shade I think uh, it's so pretty and you can see it's very very pigmented I'm using again Passionate with that brush so I can create the illusion of a crease a little bit. And with that brush from SM, I'm using Independent again onto the lower lash line. 
I like to connect the dark smoky colors together. And to give a nice highlight onto my eyes, I'm using her nest, which is a beautiful duochrome eyeshadow. It has a peachy pink undertone, which is really gorgeous. And as always, it's always best to build up the color than putting too much product because it's very difficult to remove and those eyeshadows are so pigmented. And here the lower lash line again. And honest once again onto the inner corner like this. Now we are almost done with the eyes and a little bit of blending again and I'm fixing my mistakes. And a little bit more blending here onto the lower lash line, so it's more diffused. Now the mascara from Nabla. This is Major Pleasure Mascara. This one is really nice because it doesn't smudge at all and it creates a nice curl to my very flat eyelashes. We are almost done with the look. I'm adding a little bit of lip gloss. This is Hibiscus from Persona Cosmetics. I chose that color because it gives a nice uh, tint to the lips and it gives more life to the overall look because um, I think uh, a smoky look is great with nude lipstick but sometimes it can wash out the face. So this one is a little bit tinted and uh, it's so effortless. So this is the completed look and you can see I only used three eyeshadows and it was very quick and easy as usual. I hope you will enjoy this look and please join me on Instagram where I post every single day. See you very soon.